Hey guys, my name is Simpsy. How are you all doing? It's official. James Rodriguez has signed for Bayern Munich from Real Madrid on loan. Guys, welcome back to some more official player transfer videos. If you still are enjoying this series and would like to see more, the best thing you guys can do is leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new around here. In today's video, we're going to be going through James Rodriguez's stats on FIFA. We're going to be going through stats in real life, and we're going to have a quick discussion about Hammers Rodriguez as well. So guys, let me know in the comment section down below your thoughts and opinions on this signing, which is, it's only on loan. It's a two-year loan spill for Hammers, which is going to be, I, I can't wait to see how he performs in Germany. This transfer blindsided me so much. I was reading the reports, and I was like, wait, what? I love how Bayern Munich are so, so stealthy with their transfers, just out of nowhere, boom, and they're just so efficient compared to any other club, <laughs> if I'm being honest, Bayern Munich, like, yep, we want you, he's in, he's signed, no coming to England, no coming to Manchester United, Chelsea, or going to uh, PSG, of course, so let's get stuck into Hammers Rodriguez, also, let me know in the comment section down below, what players you would like me to play with in the... Um, in, I have an upcoming, after this video is done, I'm going to actually do a potential squad for Bayern Munich for the upcoming 2017 to the 2018 season. So I'll go through all the rumors, I'll go through all the official signed players, let me know particularly what players you'd like to see. Okay, so Hammers Rodriguez, born 25 years of age in Colombia, stands at 5 foot 11, he's an attacking midfielder slash winger, he's currently on loan at Bayern Munich now. Had his youth career obviously in Colombia, played 42 matches. Matches for Banfield, scoring five goals from 2010 to 2013. He moved to Porto in uh, Portugal, played 63 matches and 25 goal, uh, 25 goals. Most South Americans sort of have an easier transition, obviously, to Spain and Portugal. Obviously, the Portu well, the Brazilians speak Portuguese, but most of the uh, Argentinians, Colombians uh, speak Spanish, of course. So it's a very easy transition. From 2013 to 2014, he played 34 games for Monaco and scored 11 goals. Obviously, after that amazing World Cup he had, man, I have so much fond memories of that 2014 Brazilian Cup when I was in Switzerland on my European gap year. I, I'll talk about that towards the end of the video. So after that deal, he had made a huge, huge move to Real Madrid in 2014, 77 games and 28 goals. Very hard to fit him in, of course, with the likes of Modric, you got Cruz, you got Ronaldo, Bale and Benzema. So uh, yeah, Zinedine Zidane has made the decision to loan him out. He's currently at Bayern Munich now. For the Colombian to, uh, international team, through his youth, the under-17s, under-20s, under he did play for the Colombian international team. And uh, yeah, for the senior squad, he played 55 matches and scored 20 goals. Okay, guys, let's move to his stats on FIFA now. He's 25 years of age, of course, 5 foot 11. Colombian can play in the attacking midfield position, the central midfield position, and the right-hand side. He is a left footer with a medium attacking work rate and a low defensive work rate. Three-star weak foot and four star skill moves. I reckon he's got actually a better right foot if I'm being honest. It should be 4-4. Four, four. Moving on to James Rodriguez's specialities. So many S's there. He's uh, got the distance shooter, crosser, uh, free kick specialist. He has the flare trait and the corner specialist. His overall on FIFA is a whopping 87. A huge, huge potential in game. He's roughly worth around about 50 million pounds and he's on 210,000 pounds a week at Bayern Munich. His main key stats are his volleys with 91, his long shots with 91, his crossing 88, his curve 87, his shot power 86, and his free kick accuracy of 86 as well. Okay, guys, so let's have a quick discussion about Hammers Rodriguez joining Bayern Munich. Let me know in the comment section down below your thoughts and opinions on this signing. Carlo Ancelotti, obviously, you guys can remember, he was the former Real Madrid manager and obviously remembered something in him and wants to bring him to Bayern Munich. So it's going 
going to be interesting to see how he plays in the cam role. Obviously, he can play on that right-hand side, so he might be replacing Douglas Costa. I think Douglas Costa plays more on the left, but he could be moving out. Ribery at Robin going to be leaving soon as well. They're getting, well, probably not soon, but they're aging. So Bayern Munich do need a bit more bite into the squad. Like I said, I, I really, really like uh, Bayern Munich's transfer policy. I don't think I heard a, a single rumor about this. It's all sort of the Premier League chit-chat. And then out of nowhere, he's on a two-year deal at Bayern Munich. Like I said, guys, I have some really fond memories of Hamas Rodriguez. I remember at, in that 2014 Cup, I was on my European gap year, and I was in uh, Switzerland for the time, and Colombia were playing their match. I think it was against Brazil. That was when he scored that absolute screamer. I was in, like, the center of Zurich with, like, thousands of people around me in, like, I don't know how to sort of explain it. They have sort of, like, public viewings of the World Cup, so we're just drinking with a couple of friends, and Hamas Rodriguez scores that absolute banger, and it was just insane to be around like so many people when that guy I wasn't even in Brazil but I just like felt the atmosphere was really really cool very much in the same boat when I watched uh, Germany smash um, Brazil. I was with my best friend who is Australian, but he's ethnically German. I was with him and all his family watching that match and they were just going ballistic in this house they lived in. But I really, really like Hamas Rodriguez. I wish him all the best at Bayern Munich. I'm a little bit sad and biased that he's not in the Premier League. Would have loved to see him strut his stuff. But it looks like Chelsea missed out on him and Manchester United didn't want him. <laughs> I'm only kidding, Chelsea fans. You probably could have got him if you really wanted to. But uh, regardless, anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Let me know the comment section down below players for the uh, potential squad for Bayern Munich. I'm going to go and make that video straight after this one. But yeah, James Rodriguez has officially signed for Bayern Munich from Real Madrid on loan. It is not a permanent deal, but is a two-year loan spell. So yeah, guys, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, check out my social media links if you want to stay connected with me. Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, all in the description below. If you guys want to get yourself some cheap and reliable games, maybe some PSN and Xbox codes, maybe Football Manager, check out my G2A affiliation link in the description below. Highly recommend Twitter. Uh, I'm back onto the social media links. I can't stress this enough. Every single time I post a video, a tweet goes out. Much more reliable than the YouTube sub box. These days, you have to click the subscribe button and uh, hit the notification squad to be a part of it hit the bell okay guys thanks guys for watching stay tuned for more videos on the channel my name is Ben Simsy goodbye Mares whips it into the box Royce that is just ridiculous with the layup Marco Royce